So you just started playing DBD and you just saw your favorite streamer land a flashy save with an angle so dirty it could be featured on an NSFW website. You want to learn how to hit those saves, but where do you aim? I mean, most of the killers have two perfectly good eyeballs, but then there's Pyramid Head. The closest thing you found to eyes are the two man mountains on his backside. Don't you worry, I'm going to tell you exactly where you need to aim to blind that killer. We'll get to the flashy timing in a later video, but timing means nothing if you've got worse eye contact than the Final Fantasy X cameraman with Lulu's on screen. So most of the killers are pretty easy. They have two perfectly good eyes that you can line up a shot for. Aim your beamer, square between the eyes, and listen to the sultry sounds of retinas sizzling. Then there are the oddballs like Pyramid Head, Dredge, and Chucky, who either have no eyes or that might be confusing on the flashy save. For Pyramid Head, you can literally touch any pyramid area from just the tip uwu to the base. Pyramid Head has no neck, only beamer-friendly surfaces. You want to try and get the center of the pyramid because while you can technically blind him by highlighting the top of his sharpest angle, it will gobble up your flashy power and take longer. With Demo, you can just hit any part of his head. Just fire away at the center of the bulb. Even if you tell Demo to say ah and fire it into the mouth hole, it's still going to get you a successful blind. This is very similar with Xenomorph, even though you can't see eyeballs, just aim your beamer just above the mouth for maximum burn. With Dredge, as my friend Sin said, you need to highlight the no-no zone. If you line your flashlight up on it and your mom walks in and sees what you've highlighted and you feel embarrassed, congratulations. Congratulations, you have successfully blinded the dredge. With Chucky, when he's in doll form, aim for the eyes. When he's doing the pickup animation, blast the guy that looks like Tommy Wiseau instead because technically that's who controls the Chucky doll in the first place. If you want to get some practice with aiming your beamer at the right spot, I went through Dino Flashy Boot Camp, so if you've got a buddy, you just have them load in his killer. If they can't play, it's all good. Just have them stand there. You get in front of them, turn your back, and try and whip around and land that beamer right in their eyeballs. If you don't have a friend to practice, no worries. We'll just piss off some strangers. Get the killer's attention. Either chuck a pallet or vault a window and hope the killer will follow you. When they do the pallet break animation, fire it right in the face. Even if you don't get it, just keep practicing because they are locked in animation with minimal movement, so you can get used to getting the beamer locked on target. Same thing with windows. When the killer starts to vault, line up your beamer. This is just practice to get your muscle memory going so you naturally start to aim at the face. On the next video, we're going to work on flashy timing, so you don't have any premature beamers and leave your fellow survivors frustrated. Let me know in the comments your own tips for lining up the perfect flashy. Good luck out there, kids. Power of friendship. <laughs> you guys cross <laughs> beams. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>